Good. Is everyone at their posts? We haven't much time, so I'll explain the details of our operation quickly. First, Dizzy, Elfelt, and myself will go to the control room in the basement to prepare our amplification procedure. Frederick has already taken his position at the top of the tower. Everyone else, I need you to defend the areas between the entrance and the west tower. If anyone attempts to obstruct us, eliminate them. Understood. Will do. On it! Wait, are you fighting too well? No, she is our insurance plan. In the event that all does not go according to our calculations, she may provide some very unique insight. I'll do whatever I can. And last but not least... Illyria Castle is not built to withstand an amplified strike from St. Elmo's Fire. There is a chance this operation may cause the building to explode. What? Godspeed! Much time before the lightning falls! Hurry! At last, the moment has arrived. Though our plans have been in motion for some time, these past five days have seemed like the longest. New experiences are what give life depth and meaning. This task has made that very clear to me. But if we have come this far, nothing can stand in our way, regardless of what Paradigm has up his sleeve. Are you actually declaring victory? I've never seen that happen before. This operation has fallbacks on top of fallbacks, and contingencies at every level. And if somehow those fail, we have one final card to play. Quite true. Then I suppose we should assist with the final preparations to ensure our coming victory. Yes, please do. Cronus. Yes. If I am to die here, I want to ask your forgiveness for leaving this responsibility on your shoulders and finding peace before you. We have all taken an oath and are prepared. Please, enjoy some tea with Baldius and the Beyond on our behalf. Axis. Librarian, I haven't always been the best comrade to you either. I apologize for making you bear witness to... everything. No. I too am an apostle. Perhaps not the best one, but I have prepared myself. Let us meet in the next life. Yes, in the next life. The next life. Detected. There's a phase shift occurring directly above us. Justice is materializing now. Impossible. This is far sooner than I predicted. Justice is approaching the West Tower. Uh. Ready 
beginning to collect energy? What's happening? Of course! They've stored it in a capacitor! Frederick, I apologize. I was terribly mistaken. Cronus plans to bind their souls to justice before activating her. Our enemies have moved sooner than we anticipated. I guess the only thing left for us to do is to trust in the Doctor, then. And try to stay calm. Indeed. <laughs> Never thought I'd be standing next to you on the battlefield again, honestly. Very true. Since the Crusades came to an end, our paths have seldom crossed. Yet here we are again, shoulder to shoulder against the wind. Would you say that's fate? Or just us not knowing how to grow up. You raise a good point. Hey, are you two friends? Friends? No, he's more like an... inspiration. What? When I was a kid, I was always the best at everything. Magic or swordsmanship, nobody stood a chance against me. Until I met this guy. I didn't know what was going on. The idea that somebody, anybody, could be better than me was... And he wouldn't shut up about being just right. I was a self-centered little shit. I was ready to write off anybody I thought was inferior. Which, by the way, is everyone. But this guy... <laughs> this guy... You know what he did? Definitely not give me the brush off like I would have done. No. It was all, let us hone our skills together, little bastard. Yeah, it pissed me off. I'm sure he thought he was just being friendly, but to me, yeah, it felt like he was just rubbing salt in the wound. R really? Damn right. So I had to do something to cheer myself up. It ended up being writing down Kai's name next to the entry for Bambina in my dictionary. His dictionary? Only now, a decade later, do I learn the origins of that nickname. <laughs> I can't exactly call you that anymore. I tried. I tried real hard. I trained all the time. I worked on bettering myself. And before I realized it, I was a pretty decent guy. A decent guy who can compliment himself. <laughs> That's okay, right? Leo. Still, if I had to grade myself, I'd probably say... C, C minus. <laughs> hmm? What's wrong? You said the Conclave were bonding with justice before activating it, right? Yes. Then does that mean the Conclave's will becomes justice's? Yes, I suppose. Oh no. What? What is it? Justice is able to control all other gears through her willpower alone. Or more accurately, any beings that have been engineered from gear cells. And just how many Opus are there in the capital? In Illyria? Nearly 1,200. Eighty percent of the world has Opus units deployed to it. Illyria was the first. The Opus with a Sanctus Populi's idea. Of course. Of course. It would be impossible for even Justice to single-handedly subjugate the entire world. Why didn't I realize this sooner? Here it comes. Man your stations! Coming. We have to split.
split up. We need to block all avenues the Opus might take. All right. Who goes where? Leo, hold your ground here. Sin, to the plaza. I will stop anything that attempts to come through the East Gate. Will do! You must hold on! We still have some time before St. Elmo's fire is scheduled to fall! Yeah, forget it. Now hurry up and do your job. Right. Mr. Paradigm? What is it? I'm going to go too. But you... I know. But if I don't do something, this whole plan is going to fall apart. No! Wait! I'm here to back you up. What? You can fight? Well, I am a valentine. Alright, good enough for me. Let's go. Yes! Is something wrong? No! I don't want to! Justice Plan. Yes, more than a few twists and turns on the way there, but Justice is awakening. The Opus will be activating soon, and I'd say things are looking good. Very soon. St. Elmo's fire ignite. wrong we've lost contact with leo i'm gonna go check on him leo has elfelt right now focus on your own mission i've taken care of all the hostiles in this area <laughs> i should have known very well then go see what he's up to thank you Phew. I see not even the High King of Illyria is prepared to be shot in the back. You, you It pains me to kill you. But a new world is about to begin, and you would be a great threat to that new world. This is nothing personal. We simply need you out of the way. For the greater good. Uh, what is it? I don't know, but I have a very bad feeling. Is it time? Frederick, get ready! It's coming! Credit where credit's due, though. Your nation has fallen for your talk of justice and fairness, hook, line, and sinker. That's not true! Impossible! I shot you! You died! They know that my idealistic dreams are only that. They can never come true. 
What my people expect from me is not a perfect and just ruler. It is something more. No matter what monsters and demons stand in our way, I have sworn never to give in. That is what my people believe. Crimson! No! No! Impossible! Who could you be? My promise to my people is that I will never bow to evil, no matter what it may cost me! you demand it will be done by our hands. Whatever you may think, ultimate power is now ours. <laughs> what? Now! Wait! Is this it? The end? We've been defeated. It's over. I hate to think that we were wrong, but in the end, we must reap what we sow. This is retribution. Huh. <laughs> retribution? We have no choice. Only the gear maker can prevail now. We should have talked more. You must escape. Find the gear maker and preserve the future of humanity. No, that's your duty. Boys, Libraria, what are you trying to. No! Frederick, no! Finally! It 
Oh. It's collapsing! Brace for impact! Uh. Oh! Oh, wait. Justice has stopped! Does this mean she's been defeated? Oh. The, the castle! It's falling apart! I need to get out of here now! Sin, are you all right? Yeah. Where's Mom? She's lost consciousness. She is fine. Please look to the others. Right, on it! Hey! Guys! If you're okay, say something! Old man! You there? Come on! Somebody say something! So hard, here it goes again. Time will wait for us, so I thought. Old man! Shut up! Hey! So, thank goodness you made it, I see. And you as well, Doctor. Is everything well? Where are the others? We're just looking for Elle and Leo. Maybe we should split up. Hey, Elle! You okay? Ah! Wait! That's not the elf you know! What? What are you doing? Hell? With Justice's awakening, my mission is complete. Heh, <laughs> figure. Are you? Come on, Nell. What's going on? She can't hear you. Just drop it. What the hell's that supposed to mean? Why won't anybody tell me what's happening? It's not that difficult. I've completed my objective. Stop screwing around. It's not funny anymore. It's not a joke. My original directive was to monitor Soul Bad Guy. I stayed close to you to stay close to Soul. We had to make sure he wouldn't interfere with our plans. Oh, yeah? Yes. We couldn't have you destroying justice. We also wanted to ensure you did not wake up. Ever. Huh. <laughs> of course. No. This is impossible. You have no reason to believe me now. Then was... Was everything you said a lie? Not precisely. My true mission was concealed from myself until now to make sure I didn't activate too early. <sighs> so, you said we don't mean anything to you now? Is that it? Everything I've experienced has been recorded. Recorded. A very important piece of the puzzle. Oh? But it's only a record. Only. Record. Record. Help! How... How can this... be good? <clears throat> yes, you can do it! You can resist it! So, don't! Get back here!
All the Valentines had emotions, even I'm not gonna try and say they didn't. So why don't you prove it to me? I... I'm... I'm... Pointless. I cannot disobey a direct order. El Felt Valentine. Eliminate all redundancies, without exception. Let me ask you one more thing. Is there any Elfelt left in there? In? I am, and always have been, myself. All of my memories are intact, so the apparent answer would be yes. Good. Now bring her back! My behavior now is in accordance with my will, and I am Elfelt. Therefore, your demand is pointless. She is already here. No, I don't mean this thing. Maybe you've got her memories, but you're definitely something different. Are you suggesting newer memories or experiences are somehow invalid? By that logic, no person would remain the same individual from moment to moment. At the very least, I can assure you that biologically speaking, I am the only Elfelt. I already know that, you idiot. If we're gonna go by your logic that we can't draw lines anywhere, then there's no difference between Earth and space. Without a clear boundary, I see no problem with that worldview. But there is a line. It's just a hard one to draw. There's a line in you too, and on one side of it is the person we know as Elfelt. Your words poison my mind. Mother's orders prevent me from destroying you. But I must ask you to be quiet for a while. Right. Reign of Judgment! Well, this is probably as good a time as any. Although I have to admit, a part of me wanted to see Soul's Awakening. But I suppose it's still a bit too soon. We may still be able to use him, though. Definitely. Well, I'll get started on the next phase, then. <laughs> Lily, not changeable. The sky is not the same no more. Books by today. If they are shiny or not, every page inside is beautiful as always. No! Who felt? No one's gonna Damn it! leave them out again. Oh, please don't wait for me, darling. Stay out of the cold rain, for you are hard made. There's no point in trying. This is absolute defense, Felion. You can't break through. Shut up! Stop it! You should know better than anybody else. This is pointless! Me? What the hell do I know? All I'm trying to hit is one of those memories you seem to have forgotten! A memory? Huh. 
You really know how to get on my nerves, don't you? Nobody tells me something's impossible. When I tried to go into the backyard after justice, you stopped me. Now I figure that was part of your plan. But the reason you gave me is something about how people shouldn't be alone. If that's not a lie, prove it to me! I'd love nothing more than to do that. What? Her emotions! Oh? Are you back? I'm sorry, but I can't fight Mother's will. Oh, don't tell me you... I'm sorry. I really, really did love making friends with you. With all of you. And I'm going to prove I wasn't lying. You're not going to self-destruct, are you? This is the only freedom I have left. Goddamn idiot! Don't! You felt you can't! If this was how it was going to end, I wish I'd never been given emotions. If this is all they lead to... Why did I have to have feelings anyway? <laughs> are very important. I understand that now. What? Mother is mistaken. You and I are not tools. You are unique to me and to sin. So I'm going to save you. I'm coming. I'm coming. Hold on! Okay, I will. I will. I'll wait! As long as it takes! Bunch of touchy-feely bullshit. What? What the hell are you standing there for? We gotta go get her back! I'm not losing anybody else. She knew it all It's a fleeting ring No one can reach the horizon She knew it all It's a fleeting ring No hands can touch the sun If you cannot stop this pathetic time Oh, bring back, bring back All I need is proof that I live Take me, take me to the end of
waiting room No way to catch the moon the Then in the end, only I survived. Where will you go now, sir? You. I have a lot of questions. <laughs> what could you possibly want to know? The battle is over. Lying is bad for your body, you know. If you're here for atonement or revenge, do whatever you wish. Alone as I am, I can hardly fight back. Ah, do you have a death wish? I would... Humbly suggest you deal with that on your own time. But before you do, I really must ask some questions. What do you plan to do with the colony? With the Japanese? The Japanese? What the hell are you talking about? Feigning ignorance? After what you've just been through, I'd have expected a little more forthrightness.
No, I swear, I don't know. All I know about the colony is that they give appropriate medical treatment to the Japanese. You... you really don't know? Those orders came from the highest levels, which would mean there is someone who outranks even you. Who could that be? Someone with more power than us. <laughs> well, that was definitely exciting. I'm glad to see it all ended well, though. Just as we planned it, and with only a small number of deviations. Are we finally ready to begin creating our absolute world? Yes, and now I must return to my own affairs. Bye-bye. For the third time, humanity faces an invasion from a wholly human enemy. Nonetheless, we took a stand and we prevailed. In the face of the trials God has placed before us, we stood united and overcame them. Why? The hope burning in millions of hearts bound us together. Heidi became our fulcrum in this time of peril. We did not cast aside hope, and we did not give in. For this, we must thank our glorious leader.